here, I'm Tony from Life Science Center, and I'm gonna bring you some activities that you can try at home. Now, I was looking at my coloring pens, and I know that I can take two colors and mix them together to make a new color. But can you separate them out? Can you take one color and split it into the parts that make it up? Well, we can try using a technique called chromatography. To start off with, I'm gonna take a piece of filter paper. These are like the kind of coffee filters that you might have at home in the kitchen. And I'm gonna take a pencil, this is quite important, it's not a pen, uh, and just draw a line using my ruler at the bottom of the piece of paper. Then I can choose a color to test. I'm gonna test the brown pen. Uh, I'm just gonna put a nice blob just on my line, just there. Now, to be able to separate out the colors, we need some water. So I'm going to fill this glass with some water. And I need to hang my paper in the water. So I'm just going to hang it over my pencil with a little clip and pop it inside so that just, so it just balances. We don't want the ink to touch the water directly, but we want the water to slowly be drawn up through the paper. Now, this might take some time, so once you've clipped it here, you might want to come back to it in a minute or two. So I thought maybe my brown pen might be made up of perhaps red and green. I know I can make brown that way. But looking at my chromatography here, I can see this brown pen is made up of yellow, pink and blue. So there's more than one way to make each colour. So you might want to try with different pens around the house and see which re results you get. Why not share your results with us on social media as well?